Hello once again, my people, it is I, Veed, and welcome back to Danganronpa 2. Last episode- what did I do last episode? <laughs> uh, Byakuya made himself leader of, of this whole entire group while we figure out why are we here. Uh, and then on top of that, it is now free time, so I get to romance whoever I want, and, uh, you know I'm gonna be choosing Kajuichi, he's my boy, because I can't do it with Fuyuhiko yet, I already looked it up. And, yeah, let's go ahead and get this started. Alright, hello, cottage! Alright, um, so I gotta leave, yeah, I gotta leave real quick. Because it's free time, so I need to go and... Get some presents! Okay, first island... Okay, so I, I'm at the hotel, but I need the, uh... I need the Rocket Punch Market. So the Rocket Punch Market is over here somewhere. Gimme, 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 gimme... Rocket Punch Market! While I'm at it, I'm also gonna be looking for some... For some... Mr... Oh, and look, Kazuichi's over here! Oh my god. Okay, well, first off, I need to see if I can find any... Um... Any... Aha! There you are! Huh? Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. Give me those Monokuma coins. Okay. So, oh, actually, you know what? Yes, I'm gonna leave here. Only because I want to try going to every single section and try to see if I can find any, um... Monokumas. So let's go to the hotel. We're gonna make we're gonna make our way back to the Rocket Punch Market. Don't you worry. I just you know want to make sure that I can find all of the Monokumas real quick because I want to try to get all of Kazuichi's presents because he's a good boy that deserves my love and attention and he deserves presents. Fuck you, Hiyoko. I don't care for you. Um, not seeing any, not seeing anything in here yet. Hotel's old building? Can I go- Oh no 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 no! This old building is in the middle of a renovation project so you cannot go inside! Fuck you, Monami! It's dangerous, you know! Showing up out of nowhere is even more dangerous. Ugh, I wanted just to, wanted to see if there was like a thing in there. Fuck you! Okay. Um... I'm not seeing anything in here, so let's go inside the hotel. This first beginning part is just going to be me looking for Monokumas, just because I want to get those coins. Oh, Chiaki, you fucking cutie. Alright, let's see here. Uh, and if you point out, if you f see any Monokumas that I just happen to not see, tell me in the comments, please. Please and thank you, because I want to get as many freaking presents as I can. Alright, let's see here. No, fuck you, Terra Terra. I'm not in the mood to talk to you. Monokuma? Mono, mono, monokuma? I am not seeing him. So we're gonna leave. Okay, so I'm not, I'm not seeing anything over here. I'm not seeing any monokumas over this way. So we're gonna maybe there maybe there's some inside of the farm. Maybe there's some in the farm. If this is boring, I'll just probably if this is boring to look at, I'll probably just cut it in editing, but I'll just probably just keep rambling off just because. Let's get turned into a moo cow. Let's get turned into a moo cow. Is there anything I'm not seeing any Monokumas. Yes, no, maybe so. I'm not seeing any. So, let's leave. And like I said, if you find a Monokuma, tell me in the comments. So in that way I can, you know, do shit. Oh, hey girl, hey girl. Uh, I don't want that. I want, I want the, I want the beach. Well, actually, I can go there, so in that way I can go to Jabberwock Park, but... For the moment... What? Hello? Oh! Mono Mono Yoshin. So I can also go to the beach to get it? In a second. In a, in a fucking sec- Oh, I didn't check on my pet. Oh, I need to check on my pet. Hold on. Hold on. I need to check on my pet. Oh my god, I forgot to check on my pet. Oh my god! Oh, Jesus. That's not what I wanted. Clean! Clean! 
Why are you pooping so much? Why are you Mr. Poopenstein? Yeah, actually, let's go this way. Plus, it'll help me level up a little bit. Okay, go to the central island. I love you, Ibuki, but not today. Not today. I, I got one man on my mind, and his name is Kazuichi Soda. Maybe you next. If I can't romance Fuyuhiko. Hi, Mana Beast. Hi, Pekko. Okay, 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 Jabberwock Puck. Who knows? There's a timer. Maybe there is a Monokuma inside of Jabberwock Park. It's a pretty imp- Oh, there's Byakuya. Hey, Byakuya. Uh, okay, I am not seeing one at the moment. I'm just kind of- Oh, whoops. I- I know, I know. I don't want to look at you, though. Don't fucking look at me, sir! Yeah, I want to leave here. Okay, so in Central Island, so then that way I can move- out of here. Like I said, I just want to do this so in that way I can level up also. So in that way I can learn more skills. Okay. Seriously, go up. Go, go, go. Hajime, run faster! Thank you. Thank you for the level up. Now I'm level 8. Okay. Um, Central Island. I already went to the beach. There wasn't anything at the beach. Um, Is there anything at the airport? There might be something at the airport. Who knows? I don't remember the airport being that super important. But there might be a- Oh, Sonia! Sonia, never mind! Ah, uh, ha! Huh? Hi, see you! I knew you could do it. Yeah, I fucking saw you, you fucking bitch! I saw you. It may have been for a split second, but I fucking saw you. Okay. So now I have 30 coins. I can buy 30 presents. And hopefully, Kazuichi will like a few of them. Hopefully. God, I hope so. I love that man. Okay, and then back to the rocket button from Mar Oh, yep! And then I made my way around. So let's go buy some presents. I need my phone so that way I can put on a timer for how much I need to cut out because I'm probably gonna fast forward. Vending machine! Monomal. Uh, purchase. Let's try purchasing something. Oh! Oh! This isn't really what I wanted, but I guess this makes things faster. No, I want to take my chances. Fuck. I should probably get going. I- no! Bitch, I want to play chance! Bitch, I want to play chance! Okay. This is gonna be fine. This is gonna be fine. This is gonna be fine. This is gonna be good. Why am I checking my mail? Stop it. Okay. Okay, I need to go on my clock. I go, go onto my clock. And then go onto my stopwatch. I don't know if you can hear me when I'm like that, but whatever. You gonna have to deal. Come on, Hajime. There we go. Beach. Okay, so the Monomal is different from the... From the, uh... Monomono... Monomono Yashin. Would you like to try your hands in the... Uh, yeah, give it a shot. All right, let's give it a shot. All right, and then I'm gonna put on a timer. Putting in a timer. And we good, okay. Hopefully I got something that Kazuichi light. Fuck you. Fuck, <laughs> fuck you, Nagito. I forgot your name again. All right, now that we got all- Oh, 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 why do you poop so much? Ah, uh, look at this little, little precious bean sleeping. Why do you poop so much? Okay, and I'm pretty sure I can give my pet some presents. I'll give my pre pet presents that I have, like, duplicates of. Speaking of which, do I have any duplicates of anything? Hold on. Um, uh, oh god, not regulations. No, not regulations. Pet. Okay, present. Can I give you a... What's it gonna be? Oh! Oh, it's hatching! Oh! It's like in a cocoon! I didn't even notice that it was like in a cocoon. Okay, Rocket Punch Market. And I'm level 9! Fuck yeah. Alright, uh, I already looked up Kazuichi Soda, what he likes. Because I want to get all the all this shit that I can get. Kazuichi! Do you think Miss Sonya's amazing? She's seriously a 100% pure blonde princess. 
I can't believe I got acquainted with someone like her. Oh, I'm so glad I came to Hope Speak Academy. <laughs> well, obviously, I wish I wasn't in our current situation. What should I do? Should I invite Kazuichi? Invite Kazuichi to hang out? Right. What? Are you and Miss and Miss Sonya too? My comrade! Let's talk about it all night long. Oh my god, Kazuichi. <laughs> I forget, he's also kind of possessive, but like... He's a good boy. I spent time with Kazuichi today listening to him endlessly praise Sonya. Looks like Kazuichi and I got uh, grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Ka Definitely! What do you like? What do you love? Okay. Um... Seven... Okay, so I need number 47. I don't have 47. 53? Oh! Yes! I have 53! Yes, yes, yes. I'm giving you this as a present. You went all that trouble just to bring me something amazing? Hajime! You're seriously a nice guy! I'm a little touched, really. Seriously, thanks! Man, why did this happen? We're on a tropical island, you know, surrounded by big blue sea, you know. And there's probably and there's plenty of ladies here too, so why do we have to be involved in all this killing nonsense? Although Kazuichi's intentions are probably not pure, I agree with what he's saying. I mean, if this was a normal school crew trip, it would have been really fun. Man, and here I thought I was finally gonna go on a school trip for the very first time. First time? Didn't you go on one during middle school? <laughs> I was supposed to, but I ditched it. <laughs> you fucking you cutie patootie. I uh faked being sick and stayed home. Oh, uh, well, I had a lot of reasons, but my family's really poor. My classmates were pretty much a bunch of broad turds, so I was like, who cares if I don't go to school? Well... But my old man found out later and beat the crap out of me. Oh, no, I didn't know that your father was abusive. Well, obviously, apparently, would be mad about that. But I sometimes get yelled at for ditching school events during elementary and middle school, too. Hey. My damn old man. Ugh. He knew better than anyone that we didn't have any money. Eh, we ran a bag shop at my place, but it's seriously odd to sell bicycles these days. The only customers we get now just need a fat, uh, flat tire fixed or air pumped. <laughs> but yeah, despite that, I'm the genius mechanic of my family. I can take a look at if, like, a bike or a car needs fixing, and I can fix anything from kids' toys to household appliances. Wow. That's pretty amazing. He's best boy! Kazuichi and Fuyuhiko are best boys! Fight me on that. Fight me in the comments. I don't care. Fight me. <laughs> I got so passionate about that. Jesus Christ. Of course. Well, I've been surrounded by junk and tools ever since I was born. So I just had a habit of taking things apart and putting them back together. I see. So that's the environment of an ultimate mechanic was raised in. Hey. My old man is just hopeless, though, so I'm always the one that's helping out in the shop. In fact, to tell you the truth, I was really excited when we first arrived at this island. Everyone here has pretty colorful personalities, but they all seem like interesting people. I was really looking forward to enjoying them youthful days here, until all this crap happened. Uh, Damn it. It's my dream, you know. I've always wanted to go on a trip with my friends and stuff. Man. Oh, wait, we're not even close enough yet to call each other friends, huh? Hmm, I don't know when people suddenly decide they're friends or not. But since we have to seem to have the same goal, maybe we can at least call each other comrades? I- Comrades! I would say acquaintances, but like, I guess comrades works as well. Comrades, huh? <laughs> that sounds pretty awesome. I'm looking forward to working with you, comrade. Kazuichi extended his hand and I gripped it. I tried to let go, but for some reason, Kazuichi was glaring at me and... So, Hajime, who are you aiming for? What? Aiming for what? <laughs> what are you talking about? You know, I... Isn't it obvious? I'm talking about the ladies. I don't swing that way. <laughs> I'm looking at you. <laughs> Either that or Nekinmaru need I because I need a muscular man on top of me. Let's be totally honest. Am I thirsty? Probably. <laughs> Quarantine is sucked. Um, depending on your answer, the alarm clock in- Oh, depending on your answer, the alarm clock in your room will be modified into a time bomb. If you have time to make something like that, you should spend it on actually being productive. It's pretty amazing that he's able to think about that kind of stuff at a time like this. But, despite his looks, Kazuichi looks like a pretty normal guy. I, lear I, I learned a little bit about Kazuichi today. Kazuichi's report card! Thank you! Bam! Did I get any skills? I guess not. Uh, after Kazuichi was finished hammering me with questions, I was finally released. How do I get skills in this game? 
Hello? It's still bright out, and I've still got some time left. I don't feel like doing nothing, so maybe I should go somewhere. More free time! Oh, right, I forget that that does that every single time that this happens. Map, where are you, Mizor Kazuichi Soda? Uh, okay, Kazuichi, Kazuichi, Kazuichi. Uh, Byakuya, no, no, no. Go outside. Okay, Gundam. Here you go. I found Kazuichi, he's out here somewhere. Oh, wait. Was he on the central island, or is he just around the central island? Oh no, he's just around. Okay, so I just gotta- I just gotta run around and just hope to find him. Okay, there's Akane. Kazuichi, my boy, where are you? Hello? Okay, airport. Kazuichi! Huh? 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 What's up with my pet? What's up with my pet? Oh, you're really cute. I'm gonna give you a present. Here we go. Get some, get some mineral water. Here you go. Ah! Aw. Okay, I gotta get your despair meter, like, all the way down right now, though. Yeah, I have to get, like, your despair meter all the way down. So in that way you don't die on me. So in that way you don't die on me! Okay. Uh, do I have any doubles of anything else? Yep. Uh, oh. <laughs> A gag ball? Are you fucking kidding? <laughs> what the fuck, dog on Rumpa? Alright, I love getting that to snake of me. What the fuck? <laughs> You know who would like that? Teru Teru. Teru Teru would love that. Alright, what else do I have doubles of? I don't have doubles of anything else. Fuck! Fuck! Alright. Oh my god, sneak me. Alright, where's Kazuichi? Oh my god. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Kazuichi, seriously, where the fuck are you? Oh, there you are. Yo. What, you bought too? Then come with me, there's something I need you help with. What, uh, should I invite Kazuichi to hang out? I'm gonna go help you. Alright, Gundam is trying to put moves on Miss Sonya, so let's think of a plan to stop him. Oh my god, of course, it's just you and Miss Sonya. I spent time with Kazuichi today, thinking of a plan that will probably never be put into effect. Uh, Kazui it looks like Kazuichi and I grew a little closer today. Uh, would you like to give Kazuichi a present? Uh, fuck yeah, I'd love to give him a present. Um, do I have number 70? I don't. Uh, do I have number 92? Nope. Alright, what do you like? You like coconut. Okay, what do you like? You like coconut juice? You like 33, uh, hopes, fuck. 43, men's mama? All right, I'll give you that. That's right. Oh, that's it. That's it. I was just thinking about how I wanted that. Right on, Hajime. You're a man who knows the difference. Man. Ah, jeez. Why aren't there any vehicles with engines on this damn island? At this rate, I'll take anything. A go-kart, RC toys, a baby carriage. Ah, oh, just let me take it with something. Baby carriages don't have engines. <laughs> There's nothing I can't dis disassemble, so I took apart the alarm clock inside my room. And when I did that, I couldn't put it back together. Oh, so there are times where even the ultimate mechanic can't fix something. <laughs> of course, that sort of thing happens to me all the time. One time I was tinkering around with, uh, without tinkering, and before I realized it, I made some kind of car thing. <laughs> For some reason, the things I fix always end up being some kind of vehicle. I don't understand that at all. Ah, uh, eh, I don't mind messing around with the frame or connecting the electric, uh, electrical equipment. But guys definitely need see something with the rumble and some bam bam bam. Hey Ajime, you know what I'm talking about, right? You know what I really want right now? Um, Kazuichi's talking about a uh, engine, probably. You're talking about an engine, right? I mean, that's what you want to mess around with. Of course. That's right. That's exactly it. Disassemble, reassemble, see how it goes. Disassemble, reassemble. You know, see how it goes. Doing that over and over gets my brain moving. 
<sighs> I really miss the smell of oil. Listen, not to be thirsty on main, but if there is a, something that turns me on, um, it's the scent of oil. I don't know why. It's probably just because it's just like, it's just like a manly scent. You know what? Oh, I thought my window was open. It's just like a manly scent. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's just like, it's just like, it's tasty. It's like tasty on a man. I don't know. I don't know. I just like Kazuichi, okay? Fucking fight me. <laughs> You're right. I haven't really smelled anything like that since we came to this island. But even if there was a car here, you couldn't drive it since you don't have a driver's license, right? How annoying. There's no way I'd do something annoying like that. I'd probably I'd just get motion sickness anyways. Oh, <laughs> I just really like the feeling of an engine running. I like all kinds of machines, but vehicles are definitely the best of the best. After all, they look so awesome. Man, I really want to go home soon and start working on my bike again. Oh, you're even making a bike, huh? My dream, my dream machine is CLC awesome, you know? You know, according to my calculations, it has a top speed of 585 miles per hour. Oh, my God. And you said you would get motion sickness. Man, I really miss Tinkin with that kind of thing. Oh, but it obviously wouldn't be street legal. And since I get motion sickness, I can't really ride it, ride it anyways. Exactly, that's what I'm thinking. But it's really cool that you're thinking of, that we're thinking of doing something that was 585 miles per hour. Like, my God. What's the use of making a ride that you can't even use? I don't understand that at all. Yay! Kazuichi's Teacher report card has been updated based on your experience with him. Where is Monami? After talking with Kazuichi some more, I went back to my room. Where is Monami? Like, I want my skills, girl. I'm gonna look that up. I'm gonna look that up real quick. Hold on. Google.com. Uh, how to get skills. Rampa 2. Uh, how do I unlock skills? That's a good one. Here we go. Um, kick open your e-handbook. You can buy- Okay! Alright, alright, I got that. Uh, the bell just now, could it be- executive committee has an announcement to make is it just a regular di uh, like sleep tight but it, 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 i guess it wouldn't mean regular because last night was the first time we went to sleep hello everyone the fun time you've all been waiting for is about to begin i wonder what festivities await you oops don't want to ruin the surprise hello it was a little meh at first but anyway please gather at jabberwock park what? Why? Why? Did you just tell us to go to the park? It's the middle of the night. What's he up to? Suddenly had a bad feeling about all of this and my goosebumps straying all over my body. If we're not allowed to defy Monokuma, then there's no way that I can just ignore this, right? Which means there's nothing that I can do except listen to him. D -d Damn it! What is it now? Alright, well, first off, let's boot open... Let's boot open... What would it be? Regulate? No, it wouldn't be that. It would be... Report card. Um, Kazuichi. Uh, Monami? Or wait, oh, Hope's Fragments. Okay, well... Okay, so I have 17 things, so let's see here. Um... I really did like using Upshift a lot. So, let's trade that in. Um, let's see here. A tentative influence. Slightly increases the influence guy. Oh, that definitely. I'd love that. Extraordinary focus. Slightly increases the focus gauge. Let's get that too. Um, lost in thought. Slightly increases for each phase. I'm okay without that. Uh, increases influence gauge recovery when chosen answers are correct. Effective when making truths choices are um cool and composed. Slightly steady. Oh, yes, I want to steady my aim, please. Um, algorithm increases the speed of memorizing a statement. Yes, yes. Oh my god, I'm gonna need that like so bad. Okay, all right, there we go. Let's. It's at least good to at least, like, get some skills, so in that way I can, like, you know, not die the first time in the first- in the first class trial. Alright, let's go to Jabberwock Park, then. Alright, what you want, you fucking bitch? Of course I'm gonna- I'm still gonna- how's my pet doing? Is it having to spare? No, it doesn't. 
I'm just like, what the fuck do you want now, you fucking bitch? This probably wasn't the right way to go, but like, whatever. It'll, it'll level me up, so in that way I can get some more skills in my pocket. The fucking bitch. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Central Island. Uh, Central Island, thank you. I need to go this way, so on that way I can go to Jabberwock Park. I should run around everywhere instead of doing just, like, fast travel, so on that way I can just... I know if for your convenience it would be better if I did fast travel, but I'm like, I want to level my shit up, dude. Alright. Oh, whoops, I didn't notice that Pekko was there. I wanted to talk to Pekko. Fuck. Jabberwock Park. Why is there a stage? Everyone was already at Jabberwock Park when I arrived. Once again, you're late. Did you, did you lose your nerve? I'd like to deny that, but he's not exactly wrong either. That's fine. Anyway, it seems everyone is here. How annoying. Uh, what is it this time? Uh, so freaking annoying. Then you shouldn't have come. I mean... Well, I mean, I don't know what'll happen to me if I don't come. <laughs> Since none of us know what'll happen, maybe you should, uh, maybe you should be the one to test that out. Hey, you might talk like you're tough, wise guy, but you wouldn't be here unless you were scared, too. Huh? What? Yeah, yeah. I guess even a big bad Yakuza like you must have been scared of that monster, huh? You... What the fuck did you just say? Wait. Stop it, you two! Fighting amongst friends isn't good! Huh? What? Did you just say friend? Dumbass. I'm not your friend, dumbass. When did I ever become friends with you bastards? Uh... <laughs> Let me be perfectly clear. I can do it, you know. No, you're not. Well, I mean, like, I know you can, but, like... No. No, I don't want you to die. Huh? You. You. What did you just say? <laughs> oh, you didn't hear me? Then I'll repeat myself just once for you. I said I can do it. Do it? What are you saying? Don't tell me. Are you being serious right now? Are you being serious for you, Hiko? Hey, Fuyuhiko, why, why don't you just, like, calm down for a bit? Bastard. Don't talk to me like we're friends or something. I live in a completely different world than your bastards. Kill or be killed. That's the kind of world I live in. Jeez. <laughs> the current rules make more sense to me than play nice and get along crap. What are you saying? If you don't stop it right now, I'm gonna get seriously angry. You... Don't treat me like a kid, bitch. Ooh. Just, stop. just stop already. This kind of fighting will not get us anywhere. Shut the hell up! There's no way I'm dealing with this kumbaya crap. If any of you guys want to die, step forward. I'll fucking kill you right now. Sounds up. fun! Give me a best shot! Oh, hi. Kane, I don't want you to die either. You're a really good girl. What's the, what's gonna happen if you're just like this easily provoked? That's enough. enough. Huh? Uh, Fuyuhiko, I understand what you're saying. I do not intend to dismiss your feelings. There was a time when I also thought the same way as you. Okay. But then what explain- the why- but that doesn't explain why Monokuma- uh, why you don't know Monokuma. Don't treat me like Are you treating me like a kid too? Let me say but what would recklessly killing- what would reckless killing accomplish? If you fail to get away with it, you know you'll be executed. Or perhaps that's what you really want. If so, hmm. you'd only be killing yourself to run away from this predicament. That's what a child would do. You. What did you just say? Listen. Listen, so long as we're here, I will not let any of you die. I will not let any of you become a victim. And that goes for you too, Fuyuhiko. I won't let you die. Yeah. What the hell? Everything you're saying, it's just empty promises! <laughs> it, uh, it's true to my word, but I uh, would ring hollow if anyone else spoke them. My name is but I am Byakuya Togami, and I am destined to bring this uh, promises to fruition. <laughs> Yowza! He's so cute! He's so cool! Not cute. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> I don't care what to say. I'm just gonna go do whatever I feel like. <laughs> do what you will. However, remember what I said earlier. I will not let any of you become a victim. That is a duty I have appointed to myself. <laughs> it seems like Bianchi resolved it. For now. But even if he's the ultimate Yakuza, there's no way Fuyuhiko really meant what he said earlier, right? Oh, you look so cute with your little suit on! Oh, cute! I still fucking hate you, but cute! Um... Uh, 
It looks like you guys were arguing, so I wasn't sure when I actually show up. It looks like I showed up at an awkward time. Hi, Chalky. <laughs> Why are you dressed like that? Oh, didn't I mention it in my recent broadcast? It's my costume for a fun time. Oh, don't tell me you're going to. That's right! Since we're on a tropical island, I'm here to do my two-man comedy routine. What does it matter if we're on a tropical island? But can you do a two-man comedy routine all by yourself? Of course not! That's why I brought my partner! <laughs> oh, Monami, you're so fucking cute in that dress, you bitch. Oh my god. Oh, uh, well, what is this? Hmm, <laughs> that figures. Now then, without further ado, I'm pleased to present Monokuma's split sh uh, side-splitting live two-man comedy show! Oh my god. Huh? I don't hear any of this. Anything about this. Are you telling me I have to improvise? I'm speechless. Oh my god, Mono TV. Hello! I'm Monokuma! Oh my god, wait, why? Oh my god, I could do a laugh thing! Oh my god. Now, I know it's sudden, but I guess I should show you guys my amazing mind reading abilities. What? Uh, you can read minds? <laughs> that button's so stupid. As practice, I'll guess your favorite food. Hmm. Your favorite food is. You can do it. It's obvious what rabbits like. Head. That's right. Dabbers. I fucking hate. I never eat a dead body. Now then, Monami's up next. Come on, do a short skit or something. What? There's no way I can do that. What are you doing, Monokuma? No worries, it's all good. I know a technique to summon the god of comedy. What? <laughs> so, which do you think is better? Taking blood while you're still alive? Or after you're already dead. I mean, taking blood when you're still alive is a little bit, like, <gasps> kinky. Uh, Why would you ask such a cruel question? Uh, <laughs> if I'm gonna summon the comedy, then I'll need a lot of blood. So, a god of comedy wants blood. Mm, pretty please. Monokuma, I need you to, like, take a step fucking back, bitch. Bye. I'm not ready for you to suck out my blood from my body. Bye. No matter how charmingly you ask, there's no way I'll let you take my blood. You're always so quick to make a scary face, Monami. You guys better be careful, too. You know, since Monami's actually a bad guy. What? She's as bad as the first villain the hero fights in a teen manga. They're always the underdog. Believe me, it's a fact that Monami's a villain. I'll let you all in on a little secret of hers. This isn't a comedy. Monami went out of her way to erase your memories. All right, Junko and Oshima, I see you. Say what? Wait, huh? You guys don't even remember how you got to this island, am I right? Mm, correct. Well... That's because Monami stole your memories! Ooh. W what are you saying all of a sudden? But wait! There's more! She didn't just steal your boring memories, like how you guys got to this island. She completely took away your memories of the years you spent at Hope's Peak Academy! What a shocker! Huh. This is all in, like, the very last trial in the last game, but it's in the first, like, the very first chapter of this game? Okay. Oh, uh, I feel great now that I've shared that with you. Seriously, hmm. memory loss plots are so old hat nowadays. Oh my god, you did it in the first game, you bitch. Only a total hack would wait until the end of the story to reveal a cliche twist like that. You're the one to fucking talk, bitch! Please stop. <laughs> students at all you guys just thought you were because you've lost all of your school memories quick some 
someone get a plagiarism because I feel like I've heard this story before. Yeah, it was the first game. You rude! Dealing with you. Backhand is far too powerful. Smack, 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 bitch! <laughs> Everyone's silent. Huh? That's... What did he mean? Hey, hey. How was it? Was it funny? Or was the comedy too highbrow for you? Come on. Hey, what were you saying just now? What was I saying just now? <laughs> oh, you mean when I said that your school memories were completely stolen? Completely stolen? Our school memories completely? What is he saying? <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's no way. Because I just entered Hope Speak Academy and then I was brought to this island. Right away. It's That's true. because of hats how you remembered it. All thanks to Monami stealing your school memories. What are you saying? That's impossible. Man, how many years has it been since you guys first entered Hope Speak Academy? I wonder what'll happen to your friends and family. They're probably worried sick about you. Maybe. Impossible. Our school memories were stolen? Th that's ridiculous! That's right. that's right, there's no way I have memory loss. You can't. Don't, don't listen to what he says! <laughs> Let me breach. I refuse I to believe mean. such a thing. Yep, everything's okay. I don't believe it. You're lying, right? Stealing, stealing our memories. That's a lie, right? You're just trying to make fools out of us, right? Wrong. Nope, it's not a lie. I mean, if it was a lie, then how do you explain this? The moment you arrived at Hope Speak Academy, you all experienced a strange dizziness. What? Uh, how did you know that? <laughs> Why, that was the cutoff point. Your memories beyond that point would have been completely removed. What the hell? I could feel myself getting lightheaded. I couldn't think, I'm, I couldn't speak. I could only breathe in heavy, gasping breaths. <laughs> Such a long time has passed since then. Impossible! Uh, impossible. There's no way! Lie. On the contrary, why is it impossible? That's Whether or not it's possible, there's no way that we can believe it. No, no. You just don't want to believe it, right? But don't worry, I'm a generous guy. I can give you back your memories. Huh? Hey, um, However, there's a catch. Could it be? Don't tell me the catch is. <laughs> <laughs> Figured it out yet? That's right. That's right. You guys have to kill each other. That's my bargaining point. Oh, uh. Oh, uh. Hey, hey. You guys want to know, right? You want to know your school memories return to you, right? Hey, then you better start killing. A penny for your thoughts is on a murder for your memories. Hey, stop running your mouth. My, my, why so angry? Uh, I'm just providing you all with a motive from the bottom of my big, generous heart. Otherwise, you cowards wouldn't be getting any killing done. Well, that's not your fault. Humans are naturally born cowards. They even cry after their mom squeezes them out of their vagina! That's why I'm giving you a motive. Think of it as an excuse to commit your future crimes. Stop this at once. Do you really think that your delusional rambling will convince us to committing murder? What are you saying? I don't even believe that memory loss clap in the first place. Hmm. But more than that, what you guys really don't believe is each other. Right? What's going on? What do you mean? Hey, um, you guys don't know each other, which means yeah. none of you realize that uh, none of you realize that a traitor is hiding amongst you, right? Huh? Fucking oh my god. There's 16 of us, so who could it be? Hey, why are there 16 of you? And if a total of 15 students from Host Peak Academy were arranged to come to this island, I got it. that's right, there's probably a traitor I don't even know about hiding amongst the group. Just kidding. You... What are you saying? All this shit about traitors doesn't make any sense. It's obviously nonsense. Lame. For real, you guys. Ugh, how can you be so sure? You guys don't know anything about each other. You don't even know about each other's true natures. That's why, if one of you is planning to kill someone, it's impossible for any of you to know. With those words, everyone felt silent. I wanted someone to argue with him, anybody. But nobody said a word. They just stood there. Uh -huh. Even so, if there really is a traitor, 
<laughs> Isn't that gosh darn awful? You're pretending to be your ally and tricking you guys. <laughs> it makes t sense for someone like that to get killed, right? <laughs> Come on! Make the preemptive strike! It's first comes, first served, and the winner takes all! Give it to me, baby! Give it! <laughs> if you want to survive, you gotta find that person before they find you. <laughs> Alright, fucking bye, Monokuma, you bitch. Even after Monokuma's boisterous laughter faded away, we all just stood there. Every one of us. This situation, this circumstance, this phenomenon, this disaster, this nightmare, this hell, this despair, it consumed every one of us. Is it true? Is there really a traitor among us? Uh, it's not me, by the way. I know I may look suspicious, but it's not me. Who is it? Hurry up and show yourself. You're only making things worse by, for you by staying silent. That's enough. Just stop. There's no way there's a traitor. There's no way. It's pointless to even discuss something so foolish. This isn't like Byakuya. Byakuya would be the first one to assume that there's a traitor among you. I won't believe. That, that's I won't right. Believe. I, I don't believe it. Because there is no way I can believe it. There's no reason in the first place to believe it. Hey. Monami, you would know. Huh? Is what Monokuma said true about our memory loss and about the traitor? Um, um I mean, everyone needs to look into the future. That's why you shouldn't look back to the past. Keep your eyes fixed up on the future. Let's do our very best. You're looking awfully suspicious, girl. Huh? Uh, she ran away. <laughs> How ridiculous. Memory loss, a traitor. It's completely fictional. Dumbass. I can't deal with this bullshit, dumbass! As he said, it's a work of fiction. It's entirely different from the reality I know. Stolen memories? All of my school memories? Everything? A traitor hiding among us? But what really struck me was when Monokuma said, You guys don't know anything about each other. I know a little bit about, you know, Kazuichi. Oh, it's nighttime! Ahem! It is now 10 p.m. Please return to your rooms and relax. Let the sound of the ocean gently rock you to sleep. Now then, sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Fuck you, Monokuma. Hey. Hey, what should we do? It's better if we call it a night here. We should get some sleep and try to keep our minds calm. Oh. I guess you're right. This is your leader. Just so you all know, do not think about unnecessary things. This is your leader's orders. Tomorrow morning, let's meet at the restaurant after Monokuma's morning announcements. Uh, How troubling. I think the saying goes, I am frightened so stiff. Huh? I feel pretty stiff right now, too. Shut up, Teru Teru, bitch, bye. Uh, That's not how the saying goes. But it's not her fault, she's the foreigner after all. Man, everyone's going after Sonia. To be honest, I don't really remember what happened after that, but later, I realized something. Hello? I was sitting on my bed inside the cottage, with my head drooping down to my chest. As I sat there alone, a strange thought suddenly crossed my mind. Traitor. Could it be? Someone who isn't like the others? Like someone who doesn't even remember what their talent is? What the hell? I don't understand at all. I put these stupid thoughts out of my mind and collapsed onto my bed. Immediately, I closed my eyes. Closing my eyes was the only thing I could do to escape from this other world reality. Monokuma Theater! I just want to pause! <laughs> they say impossible is a word that only found in a fool's dictionary. Obviously, it's impossible to use a word that's not in your dictionary. If someone can actually make the impossible possible. You can, you can truly call a person someone who doesn't have the impossible. All right. Ding dong, bing bong, bitch. All right. Yes, I know. Good morning, everyone. Now then. All right. Yeah, we we heard all that before. I slowly and awkwardly st sat up on my bed. Both my head and my body felt heavy, but. It was still an improvement compared to last night. We all said we'd meet at the restaurant. Alright, and I'm gonna go ahead and pause the episode right there. 
thank you all so much for watching. My name is Veed. I hope that you had a wonderful time watching this. I hope that you had a wonderful time watching me get to romance Kazuichi and be given a motive for killing, which, no, I don't want it. Uh, make sure to hit the like, comment, subscribe button down below. You know how to follow YouTuber out. Make sure to hit the notification bell so that we don't miss up on any of my uploads. And I will see you in the next episode. <laughs> Goodbye.